at the half court in uh, limiting the touches of Alan Liwag. Yes, so uh, ang ganda ng game plan ito ng, uh, ng coaches ng, ng San Sebastian going 2-3 uh, zone and they're doing, they're still doing yeah. it. It, was, it has been effective for them. Yeah. Why fix it if it ain't broke? Sabi nga nila, Liwag, this time he got the touch. So he fishes a foul right away. But you saw the swarm, the triple team. Diba? Nag, uh, talagang pumalibo dito kay Alan Liwag dun sa tira na yun. Actually, partner, I think they went to a man-to-man -man itong San Sebastian. Kasi nung nakuha ni Liwag yung bola, nag-backdoor, sumunod yung tao. So, that opened up for him. Ito si Liwag on the post. But Alan Liwag hasn't been the best day for him at the line. Only 50% so far. Four out of eight. But he does have 10 points and four rebounds. He is the number one rebounder in the league at about 12.7 rebounds per game. He misses both. Empty trip. And here comes Bolo Gaban. Feeding Suigo. And he scores on the reverse. Good have passed by Gaban. Attacking. And the white shirts by himself going uh, from court to court. How about Polo Gabat has made the mark offensively with his scoring in the first half. Now, he is starting to set up his teammates. Jamel Ancheta. Ancheta. Ah, oh, floats it up and in. That's high off the window for Jamel. Very calm to see Jamel Ancheta attacking the basket. Even on uh, the pressure. Uh, going two big guys. First field goal today for Ancheta. Pelebrico. Shot block is at seven. Gabad will take this matchup with Sanchez. Gabad, oh, another rejection by Justin Sanchez. And I'm going to ask Justin Sanchez with his, uh, with his length, immobility, yeah. guarding at the Gabad. Yung blocking niya, kita natin yun to end the ball, to end that uh, second quarter with the block. That's right. Second block of the game for Sanchez. Drive by Sanko and he finishes with his offhand. And he runs gingerly the other way. Of the awkward landing, ito si Sanko. Pahinari is being pressured by Ancheta. Are fakes the hand of Are breaks free. What a move there by Pae. Are evading misdirection. Angada. Cometa trickles that one home. Back and forth we go. And now, Teta Gabat. Ah, Basa. Anthony Sanko. Sanchez on the move. Ancheta. Side steps will be fouled by Pascual. Count it. Plus one for Jomel Ancheta. And now we throw it back court side from uh, the dugout. Ng San Sebastian. And Dito, see si Aaron G. Aaron, go ahead. Three's fleeting and defeat is never fatal. It is the courage to continue that count. The San Sebastian Golden Stags know this all too well. And as we can see, they are more than hungry for redemption. Back in the dugout, coach Arvin Bonleon reminded his players to stay focused stick to the game plan and also attack the gaps in Benil's defense and keep their energy up high in order to get back up in the hopes of setting the tone for this second round. Although the stats may have been considered as the underdogs of the NCAA, kinalabrin sila sa kanilang timely comeback. So let's see if their resilience and fight spirit will help them get back to the win column. Balik sa inyo, Martin and JP. Thank you so much, uh, Erin. Well, for San Sebastian, kahit kilala sila dun sa fourth quarter comeback, dito may chance sila na lumapit sa Benilde papunta sa ating fourth quarter. That's gonna be an easier job for them in trying to hang around. Ah, so ayaw nila yung partner. Gusto nila, mahirap. Kaya nga fourth quarter comeback sila kilala eh. <laughs> Pero kita natin dito, Benilde Blazers, Sanko, scoring again for them. Talagang nakikita nila yung flow nung game nila, nung uh, start of this ball game. Yeah. Oh, wabalik na ulit sila. It's been an overflow of points for Benilde here in the third. 11 to 6. That's the start of the Blazers here. Kaya, siyam na puntos ang kanilang abante dito. 
Mark Sango to the line. Free throw is pure. Pascual facilitates. Oh, hard screen by Philip Rico. Philip Rico now. On top, gets it to Baeng. Are pulls the trigger. Are drops it in from deep. Baeng Are finally converting on those rainbow, rainbow art. Yeah. Much needed for him because it's really hard to when Are drives to the basket. 15 points now for Baeng. Sanchez. Ancheta. Ancheta with the left hand. Tomel Ancheta going left, going right, finishing with the left again. What a move there by Tomel Ancheta. And the ability! Ooh, wow, that's a bully move! That's pure strength there by <laughs> Paeng Are against Tomel Ancheta. That's a guard version of a weight room move. <laughs> For Paeng Are, look at his speed. And it's both guards dueling here. Let's check out what happened. Paengare off the screen. Given space, he takes advantage. Ancheta crafting his way to the rim. But look at this. Oh, Paengare. Just pure power. Paengare, now it's Ancheta with him. Just right bump there. Straight to the basket. Kick out all day for Sanchez. Too strong that time. Oh, rebound for Sanko. Jomel. Sanchez will wait. They go underneath. Foul on the floor. That's on Gabat. Wala ka na magagawa nun if you're uh, Polo Gabat. At San Sebastian, ha? James, penalty na. Anim na minuto po tayo dito sa ating third quarter. Kung sa season 99 ay may new heroes of the game, itong unang siglo ay meron ding OG heroes ang NCAA. Hindi lang kasi mga sports legends at mga sikat na celebrities ang naging bunga ng NCAA schools. Kundi pati na rin ang mga pambansang bayani ng Pilipinas at dating presidente. Produkto ng Kolehyo de San Juan de Letran ang mga revolusyonaryong sina Apolinario Mabini at Emilio Jacinto. Ganun din ang mga dating presidenteng si Manuel Quezon, Sergio Osmeña at Jose P. Laurel. Si Ramon Magsaysay naman ay produkto ng JRU. Si Fidel V. Ramos na nakapag-high school sa Mapua at si Rod On our uh, featured players, Alan Liwag, 10 points, 4 boards, Paeng Are, 17 points, 3 uh, rebounds, 1 assist, 2 steals. So these players, James, proving to us what they're here on the screen. Now, why they are the identified three players? Oh, no, man. Of course, we can see the pandangan of Paeng Are there. But at the same time, it's not shooting efficiently on the floor. Yung kabalik na naman ni Alan Liwag, just providing the defense, yung getting those fouls. Kaya ngayon, penalty na ngayon sa Sebastian. It's because of him. But you also got a credit back to, I've been looking at Justin Sanchez. He's been looking at Alan Liwag every time when he seals. Even on their last possession, five seconds left on the shot clock. We thought he was going to shoot the ball, pero nakita niya si Liwag on the post. That's probably the number one priority for Coach Charles to address at the dugout, no? Feed the ball inside to Alan Liwag, especially when he is in position early. Oh, no, man. Why not? Kasi wala siyang katapat. Height-wise, maybe strength-wise, meron. Height-wise, wala sa line-up ng San Sebastian. Kasi you also want that, yung ganung kind of play, inside out, get the ball inside, nakita ni Liwag on the double, triple, kick out niya, ikaw naman may libre. Ancheta. Si Gabat at Pasua na may pagkahan doon. Sino ang foul doon? Si Gabat. Si Ancheta pa yata. Are, misfires. Ball, ends up with Gabat, Gabat, collapse! And the foul for Rex Gabbard. With the offensive rebound and those uh, that two-point shot there. Again, 
It's the peskiness of San Sebastian getting active on the rebound to the delight of their head coach, Coach Arvin Monleon. Oh, usually, uh, nagpapalamag dito eh. Yung mga alam mo, nagbubulusok itong uh, building places bilang may makasagot itong uh, San Sebastian. Ibababa, ilabat sa anim na punto sa kabante ng Pinillo. Sanchez is trapped. Stolen by Are. Pakinti discarte. The beat to Philip Rico. And TJ scores. Nagulat itong CSP. Pinillo na double naman yun. Ano nga si Bastian? Kasi kanina nakaputuan lang sila eh. Tapat-tapat lang biglang nag-double. So nagulat ito si Justin Sass. His turnover. Two points again. Para dito sa San Sebastian. So here's the counter adjustment of Maste defensively. Sanchez, kick out. Sampo, purado. Si Paeng. Offensive foul called against Mark Sampo. Ito yung trap nila kay Justin Sanchez. Ball ending up with Paeng Are. And Paeng leaving it to their captain, DJ Philip Rico who finished on the break. But our officials will review that last play with Mark Sanko and Paeng Are. Paeng is still down. They're looking for the medics. Oh. Oh. He will be attended to here. Oh, yeah, he's bleeding. Ah. Yeah. On that mm -hmm. upper lip. Let's see this play, Japes. Oh, yeah. Yeah. That's an elbow to the face. Uh -oh. oh, yeah. You can hear the crowd here. You can hear the play. But obviously, it's accidental. Just unlucky there for uh, playing Ari. Really, really playing well for, uh, for the Stags. Now he's being checked mm -hmm. by our medics team. Okay, it's Tawag. Unsportsmanlike foul on Sanko. A bad review. Foul was upgraded to unsportsmanlike foul. Great mm. right, two on number nine, Mark Sanko. For excessive hard contact caused by a player in an effort to play the ball or an opponent. Yeah. Oh, hey, there you go. So it was upgraded, Javes. Excessive contact. So on defense, um, ang argument naman ito ng CSB coaches, I can see the yeah, uh, yeah. the height difference, obviously. Correct, correct, correct. Between Are and uh, talagang when you, when he attacks and lead ni ano ni Are, talagang matatamaan mo siya. Kasi kung mas malaking, mas matangkad the player, abutin lang yung chest part. Yes. Oh. Hopefully Are is okay and can come back on this game. Yeah. So he's being checked. I don't think he's done though. I think he'll come back. For sure. Yeah. This is... Dude, go sa ngipin pa, Jibs. Let's see the ngipin there, no? Jibs, you know that you're a mouthpiece. You're not a mouthpiece. You're not a mouthpiece. At saka medyo mahal yung mouthpiece nung tayo. <laughs> medyo mahal. <laughs> medyo tipit ka ba kapag college-college. Ngayon ka kayo eh. oh, Wala ka pang ano, nun, salary. No, but if you're with the amount of unsportsmanlike fouls that we... Oh, when, when you play the NCAA, it's, it's a must. Yeah. Talaga. We're a mouthpiece. So, Adelar. Blank on the first. One possession game now, 58 to 55. Paengare is being iced. Partners, a big loss. Para di sa crucial stretch. Ito ng third quarter na tayong paengare on the sitting on the bench. And we're still not seeing Ray Martinez be the same. Yeah. Ang pinalet si Nico Aguilar. Aguilar. Pass inside, Suico. Just missed it. That's good pass there. Good uh, possession there by this uh, stack. Cometa. They feed Liwag again. Ooh! Cometa recovers. High pass. 
Oh, and that's on San Sebastian. So this will mean free throws. More free throws for Alan Liwag. Uh -huh. But how about the heads up play of Gabi Cometa? <laughs> that's a good pass there by Cometa. Talagang uh, Pinoy ball uh, going towards. Ito si Alan Liwag. <laughs> Yung pasa na yun, sinigurado niya na si Liwag lang makakaabot. And it's a high arcing pass. Yeah. Si yung straight, eh, di ba? Alam niyang... Ay, di naman si Liwag. Eh. Uh -huh. Ayan, ah, nag-uusap sila dito. Alin Liwag. Pero kita mo yung attention na nakukuha yung ito na rin dito yung pass. Ito, ah. The retrieval. Oh, ito mo yan. Ang tasa, no? Tasa nung pasa. Score natin. <laughs> Sakto rin sa posisyon ni Liwag. Pero kita mo naman, when Liwag, when Liwag gets the ball on the post, another miss there for Liwag. Pero when he gets the, the ball on the post, talagang collapse. Nah. Four players, four red shirts going into the paint. Kaya libre sana doon si Cometa. This uh, miscommunication there. Hey, you know, Liwag is the focal point. Oh, he trickles in the second free throw. He has gone 7 out of 13 now from the line. Para dito kay Alan Liwag, 59-55. Aguilar, Dumi Discarte. Rizzo, Pascual. Ooh, ooh. That's Acheda. And uh, Risho hitting the floor. Yeah, moving screen there. Uh -huh. And the handoff. Are you? Yeah. The Hila, the Montinia. The Jose Acheta. Acheta. Baka si Matapaka. So Oli checks back in with those three fouls. Acheta. Sanchez, Bumomba, Justin Sanchez off the bank. Big boy move from Sanchez. That's pure power and pure skill there. But uh, it was Sanchez. And he stretches their lead to six. Gabad, too strong. Angela, Nagmamadale. Jamel will wait. And it's Suiko fronting Liwag. Anjeta now. Anjeta surveys. Sanchez from straight away. Sanchez knocks it down. Well, see, Sanchez actually wanted the ball on the post then. But he didn't give it up to uh, Eto Kai Liwa. He got the ball back from Jomel. Hit that three pointer. It's his turn now. To take some shots for Benio. Seven points for Justin Sanchez. Gabat. Abuelo. That's a foul on Sanchez. Two free throws will be given to Rex Gabat. How about this? Sanchez oh, against Risho. Second bump. Kita mo dito also si Jumel Ancheda. Nice pass there to Justin Santos. He's been uh, the playmaker here. Yeah. He's actually after this whole game. Assisting, not scoring that much. Pero yung the way he pushes the ball, really quickening up the pace. Not only, you know, I think it's a fast break, but you can see the defense, transition defense. It looks like he's going to That's right. And Cheta now with four assists. So, ito na, Remark Escobedo is in the ball game for Paste. Rex Gabat will try to bring them closer. He does. Splitting his charities. Cheta, risky pass. The save goes to Sanchez. Sanchez, call for the eight second violation. Pressure successful for San Sebastian. Meantime, let's go to a quick break. 256 left. It is happening third quarter. Alam nyo ba na meron ding kapuso stars ang nag-aral sa NCAA schools? 
Ilan sa mga ito ay sina Yasser Marta na naging team B ng San Sebastian bago lumipat sa LPU. Si Anthony Rosaldo naman ay galing sa Arellano at si Rocco Nasino na naging Mr. Mapua pa. Mga perpetualites naman sina Kailin Alcantara at Shaira Diaz, habang tubong St. Benilde sina El Villanueva at David Licauco. Proud Bedans naman sina Sofia Ceneron, Christopher Martin at Andre Paras. At syempre, ang kapuso primetime king na si Ding Dong Dantes ay galing San Beda at naging miyembro pa nga ng cheering squad nito. Yan ang NCAA sa Siglo Uno. Welcome back to the coverage. And now let's get an update on the status of Paeng Are. Let's have Erin T again. Erin. Mga kapuso, I just spoke with Paeng Are's medical team and he sustained an injury in his upper lip. Upon checking with his medical team, they are covering his injured upper lip by putting eyes on it right now. And according to them, Are can go back if it stops bleeding. That's all from Courtside. Balik sa inyo, Martin and JV. Thanks for the update, Erin. That's great to hear if you're a San Sebastian fan. Paeng Are can return to the game and these guys on the court are holding the fort yep. for Baste. Oh, you can see that uh, three-pointer. Ito ni uh, Suiko. Uh, not only that, ito pressure defense. Uh, Binapato ng uh, San Sebastian. It's just nakakagulat eh. Yeah. Kasi minsan tapatan lang. Pero now, they're really putting up the pressure, doubling. Itong on the corners. Alam mo, may mga moments dito sa third quarter natin. Nakakala natin. Nakakalagwa na ang video. Oh. San Sebastian has found answers. Suiko couldn't make it back to back. Oh, how about Gabat? Who towers for the board and that put back. Gabat, where did it come from? Snatching that offensive rebound. Ball pressure still for Baste. But then Sheta calmly brings it across. Oli to Liwag. Morales pulls the trigger. Left it short, ball is tapped, it goes to Aguilar. Forward pass, Risho. Risho underneath, and he puts it in. What a collective effort here by the Stags. Just everyone pouring, putting in offense, defense. Okay, yeah. this will put Jomen and Cheta at the free throw line. How about this? Ian Suiko finally gets one from the outside and after that they force another turnover here's the fast break na iwanan ng bahagya itong si Christian Risho defense was late to react and Kapat wow getting the board right over the 6 foot 5 Justin Sanchez it's just an effort here the last uh, 3 minutes of our third quarter lamang na lamang out hustling Yes. Itong uh, Bill Blazers, Coach Charles Shu not liking what he's seeing. So, talagang uh, balasa ulit. Uh -huh. Antonio Sebio is back in the game for Benilde. Roger Ondoa. This is uh, his second entry. Kanina pumasok siya but only played 14 seconds. That was in the inside the, fight, uh, the final minute of our first half. This is Roger Ondoa. Rookie from Iba Zambales. And also a hustle player for the Blazers. Jomel Enchata at the line. Partner, magugulat ka. Out rebounded on the offensive side. Talk about offensive side. Eusebio yeah. grabbing uh, the offensive rebound. Pero lamang. Lamang na lamang itong uh, San Sebastian with the offensive rebound. Especially on the second chance points. Precisely. Undersized sila, pero yung, yung hustle nila. And they're, they're going, uh, they're doing the 2-3 zone. So, yeah. every time you can get offensive rebound there, five uses on CSP, pero lamang, ang San Sebastian. 15-3 lead in second chance points for San Sebastian so far. Risho makes his move. Risho! Oh, the defense by Eusebio. Ian Torres will set the table for Benilde. Pakik sa kanya. Oli! Too strong. Rebound is grabbed by Philip Rico. Approaching the final minute of the third. 
Escobido, Escobido! Oh, 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 oh. What a move! Reinhardt, Escobido with a Tony Parker speed yeah. move there. And San Sebastian is in front. Wow. 65, wow. 64. And that's what they needed. Yeah. Uh, Escobido. Oli. Torres. Torres floats it. Short. There's a whistle first. That's on Aguilar. Penalty night of San Sebastian. How about this move? Remar de Escobido. A spin cycle. And smoothly lays it up and in. It's a better uh, offensive possession there by Ito Remar de Escobido. Going to the flow, going to the ball screen, just attacking. And Tom Depensa, Eusebio. Yeah. That's his first field goal, by the way, for uh, Ray Martin Escobedo. Ito na partner, ito yung magandang tandem. <laughs> yeah. Paeng are Escobedo. At the same time, nakuha ng Escobedo yung first basket niya. Yeah. 65 all. Only the second deadlock of the game. Ian Torres. Perfect from the line. Ito yung uh, tawag ni Coach Charles, Barangay Liwag. Barangay Liwag. Oh, diba? Grabe yung support. Pamilya ni Ali Liwag. Sixty-six, sixty-five. Tenth lead change so far. Gabad for three. No. That was, that was a bit early. Yeah. And go for the final shot. Ia Torres, the beat on Doha with the finish. Brilliant execution for the Blazers to end the third quarter. And they end the three quarters. And they slightly extend their lead. Ia Torres operating and setting up Roger on Doha underneath. Plus two for Benilde. They're a plus two, a three versus San Sebastian, 68 to 65. When we return, we'll give you the payoff period of this battle between the Blazers and the Stags.